with a little coconut. Ja, ja, ja. I watered, and I waited, and I waited, and I waited, and I just don't know what's going on down there. <laughs> well, did you put the soil in? Uh-huh. Okay. And you said you watered it. Uh-huh. So... <gasps> Sandy, what about... The it. The seed. Did you put the seed in? What the seed? What's a seed? Oh, Sandy. This is a seed. It's kind of like a baby plant. And from a baby plant, we could grow perhaps a big tall tree or a pumpkin or a radish or maybe even a beautiful flower. Would you like to know how it works? Well, deep down underneath the soil where the insects crawl and the earthworms coil, something's found down below. It's the part of a plant from which a new plant will grow. This is the story of a seed so tiny and round. You make a little hole and push it in the ground. The earth gives it food, water rains from above. Give it a little bit of time and a whole lot of love, love, love. The roots grow down, stringy and long, and they take in water to make the plant strong. The roots twist and turn to hold the plant tight. A stem pushes up toward the bright sun. branches sprout leaves and the leaves sprout fruit and in the fruit there are seeds the fruit falls down and the seeds fall out and they go in the dirt and more seeds sprout this is a story of a seed so tiny and round you make a little hole and push it in the ground You make lemonade and then you sit back relax under the lemon tree shade Remember that tall tree started from a seed and old mother nature gave it all in This is the last time I asked Kevin to do my project for me. She never asked me to do her project. 